Namaste. Today we are going to talk about rich thinking versus poor thinking. I'm not going to talk about rich versus poor, but I'm going to talk about that our thinking make us rich or poor. And indeed, there is a difference between the thinking um, pattern or the thought process of the rich people versus the poor people. Rich thinking people hold their emotions tightly. And they also take their decisions practically. They avoid toxic people and stay away from all types of negativity in their life. They don't blame to anyone in their life for their failure. They own their success and they own their failure as well. Poor thinking people, on the other hand, or I should say poor thinking habits, refer to the ways of thinking that produce adverse effects in every part of our lives. They can negatively affect our personal progress, our relationships, and everyone around us. But they do more than that, actually. So we are going to number it and look at the differences. The first one, it's the mentor mindset. Rich mindset understands that it can never know everything and that something can be learned from everyone. Remember, you can learn something from everyone. Poor mindset dilutes itself into believing it knows everything and that opposing perspectives are wrong before even hearing them. It would not like to hear anything which goes against their own thinking and that stops the growth. That makes it a poor mindset. Second, rich people make their money work for them, whereas poor people work for money. I repeat it again, rich people make their money work for them, whereas poor people work for money. They work 24 seven, they work for money and nothing else. Third, rich people think big, poor people think small. But hear this, it's not about you. It's about living your mission. And it's about living true to your purpose. It's about adding your piece of the puzzle to the world. It's about serving others. Most of us are so stuck in our egos that everything revolved around me, me, and more me. But again, it's not about you. It's about adding value to other people's life. It's about your choice. One road leads to being broke and miserable but the other leads to money, meaning, and fulfillment. Remember, it's your choice. Fourth, poor thinker fear to take risk. So as per poor mindset, I don't think I can do it, so I won't risk failing. I don't think I can do it, so I won't risk failing. Rich mindset, even if I fail, even if I fail, I have unlimited opportunities. I can learn something from the failure. Fifth, poor people will do almost anything to avoid problems. Poor people will do almost anything to avoid problems. Rich people, they invest money, whereas poor, poor people, they save money. And that's the difference. Rich people invest money, poor people save money. Rich people act according to intelligence, whereas poor people act based on feelings. So it's your choice that what would you like be? You can be a poor thinker or a rich thinker, but it depends with whom you spend your time. It doesn't necessary to be surrounded by rich people. You can get your habits and mindset through reading books, and podcast. So try to be with the correct set of people. You become like your company. So try to be with the correct people. Thank you. Namaste.